I'm Chris Wills, Director of Training at RDI Technologies, and I'd like to welcome you to another installment of Tips and Tricks. So I'm here in RDI Acquisition, and I'm acquiring data on this asset. And of course, uh, a couple of the things that I need to record in, in my recording properties are the, the distance and the focal length, the lens that I'm using. Uh, these both uh, are really important if I'm going to measure accurate amplitudes. Uh, and so what happens very often is we make this measurement and then we forget where exactly did we, did we measure the, the distance to on our asset. So now all I really need to do is here in acquisition, once I've made the measurement, I can go to the locations button up here, click the locations button, and I now get a marker for my default location. And so now I can just push my default location marker to where I've actually measured this distance and it's no longer a question. So now I can record my data and then when I'm finished recording I can open up my recording in motion amplification and now once I'm in motion amplification and I'm analyzing my data I can go up to the locations button again and I can see exactly where that default location is and I can also move it to a different location here if needed. This is Chris Wills reminding you to visit us online at www.rditechnologies.com for the latest motion amplification tips and tricks. Thank you.